That's a good cup of coffee. Well, good morning vlog. I hope you are all having an awesome day so far. Today is Wednesday, September 11th, and I woke up today and I decided I really wanted to do just like a cozy home type of vlog. So I really want to take you guys through the rest of the week and just kind of show you what I get up to day to day. I always feel like those are the types of vlogs that I like watching. Just like super chill, cozy content. And I kind of feel like I'm finally at a point now with summer activities kind of being over and like kind of the cozier weather to like really actually do some of these cozy vlogs that I love to see. I also feel like I've really been craving getting into a routine again. We had the busiest summer, the busiest and best summer ever. But yeah, my plan for the day is just to kind of take it a little bit more easy. I have some client work today, so I will get some of that done. I want to do a little bit of tidying and cleaning just to kind of keep the house under control for the week. I need to go grab some just like groceries, do some light errands. I have like some kind of exciting home updates that are coming. I don't know if they're gonna be in this vlog or the next one, but definitely stay tuned. But it's kind of gloomy, it's not raining anymore. I think I'm probably gonna wear this Aritzia bodysuit that I got last year. I still really like it. One thing I really like about these square neck bodysuits is that you don't have to like rip them over your head to get them on. And like then it gets all your makeup on the shirt. Do you know what I mean? Oh my god, there is the biggest spider. Let's catch up later. just on this one hill. There's so many like, different types of trails. So I can just like meander around. head out here because I really need to get some work done so I need to go to a coffee shop um, but I thought I would show you guys what I'm wearing this has been a very standard outfit for me recently I cannot tell you 
how much I've been wearing these jeans recently. They are so cute. Like, and just the perfect amount of baggy. I definitely am in love with these. And I'll probably be wearing these on repeat for all of fall. Um, my shoes, my little Mary Janes are vagabond. My cardigan is rails from a couple years ago. I think they still make this style though. Um, my bag is flattered. My belt is vintage actually. Um, and my little tank is from Perfect White Tea. So yeah, this is the outfit. Iceland and then she came home with this coffee milk chocolate. You can never take off the sticker without ripping the paper. Honestly, this is so soft. I'm probably gonna have to take it off immediately because it's actually quite warm right now but you can just smell the scent how good it smells ooh ooh intensive repair anti frizz serum and then there's this cute little look it's like all wood and then like you in the shower, you like massage your scalp. This one's a lot nicer than the one I have. Mine's like just kind of a cheaper one, but this is so nice. I'll just use a little bit to start. My ends have actually been so dry. I know I always say that, I feel like a broken record, but this time they actually are really dry. Um, okay, last, but not least is something I actually bought for myself and I already unboxed it because I got really excited. Here's my brand new little baby, this little Ralph Lauren card holder. Oh, I got it from Vestier Collective and it's literally brand new and it's got all of these like little places for cards in the back, that little slot there and then just like a little place for coins or cash or whatever. Um, but yeah, it was brand new. And I really like the color, I like this brown. And then it has these like handy little chains if I like wanna put my keys on there or have like a keychain or whatever dangling off it. So that is the last thing that I have. That is new. I noticed that I had a voicemail 
from the shipping company that's bringing our new bed and they say they're coming tomorrow. So I actually have to work in Victoria tomorrow, unfortunately. So I tried calling them back. But anyways, the bed is coming tomorrow and I wrangled my sister into hanging out here tomorrow um, to get the bed and make sure it gets like set up and everything. Bless her soul for doing that. But that means that I have to get this bed out of here like tonight. I feel so bad I'm gonna have to disturb your sleep, honey. I'm gonna have to disturb your sleep, baby. So basically, this bed is getting replaced with a massive king size bed. Um, which honestly is going to be kind of comically huge in our bedroom. Mm -hmm.